world, I'm Maya Sundermeyer and I would like to welcome you to the latest episode in my vlog series. So far I have been able to share my own experiences on what it's like for me to live with Asperger's Syndrome. A second thing that I will do is uh, give my two cents on what's going on with autism in the media. A third area entails providing tips and advice for those of you that are on the spectrum. I will also reach out to your friends, family members, peers, mentors, educators, employers, and anybody that is inside the autism community. And finally, I uh, will cover topics on things that I'm passionate about. But before I dive into uh, this afternoon's topic, I have a few things to mention. So first and foremost, please be sure to check out my uh, written content on WordPress.com. And uh, these are uh, practical application and scholarly research types blogs that I like to do. And please be sure to check those out because uh, you might find some practical steps that I think could help. And secondly, uh, I would like to recommend that you check out this video called Amazing Things Will Happen. And this is about uh, not only spreading autism awareness, but also autism acceptance as well. And the reason why I wanted to put that up once more is because there has been some debating on uh, whether or not uh, we should stop using autism awareness because so many people already know about autism and that we should start uh, spreading autism acceptance and uh, just uh, pushing that. And I uh, had a few comments to say about that and here's some tips and advice. So though I believe that autism acceptance is very, very key and very, very important, and I do believe that it's a key to helping somebody on the spectrum get into careers and go to college and get married. I do believe that autism awareness is still very important. And then uh, autism acceptance comes next. So first and foremost, in order to um, have somebody accepted, we need the right people that are going to um, raise autism awareness and not as if we're people who are broken and different and less. No, we need people that are the opposite. We need uh, people on the spectrum like myself and like Jennifer O'Toole and Dr. Temple Grandin and uh, like uh, some of these people like uh, Carrie Magro that are going to spread the autism awareness, but we're gonna do it in a way by using positive evidence to back us up in order to educate people. And that awareness uh, starts in your small communities. And that's when you do slideshows. That's when you do presentations. That's when you talk about your experiences. And that's where you grow the autism acceptance. Because um, without that awareness of um, what's going on, people are still going to freak out over us because a lot of times people with Asperger's syndrome and autism are seen as jerks and we're seen as people who uh, take things too seriously and not literally. And when we do try to educate them, they say, well, that's not an excuse and they don't accept us. So the best thing to do is to educate and that's where the awareness comes in. And then uh, from that education, that's where you need to build on the acceptance. So. Anyway, I'm out of time. If you like what I'm doing, please be sure to subscribe to my channel and also be sure to check out my content every Monday and subscribe, subscribe and also comment below. Most importantly, please be sure to share these with your autism groups and share these with your schools and share these with absolutely everything that you can get your hands on because um, the more we, uh, we raise awareness, the more we raise acceptance as well. So until next time, I'm Maya Sendermeyer and I'm signing off. Bye.